is one critical measure. That Dr. David Fisman is known for speaking his mind and not holding back. This is not true just from grade three onwards. The doctor is one of many advising the province. He has also done work with a major teachers union. Members of the science table are required to disclose their professional relationships. This information is publicly available. As of Tuesday, his relationship with the union is listed. And the link between Fisman and the teachers union has not been a secret. This press release from October 7, 2020 is one example. It lists Fisman as one of the experts sharing views on the province's flawed return to school plan. The union said they did retain Fisman over the summer to provide an expert opinion for a matter at the Ontario Labour Board dealing with safe working conditions. He was paid for his work. The government was represented at that hearing. They had all of the documents and affidavits provided. Any suggestion whatsoever that uh, Dr. Fisman's opinion was based on the fact that we were paying him for it is absolutely absurd. In a statement Tuesday night, the Premier's office said, given Fisman's role on the science table, the news about the relationship is deeply concerning and that they learned about this matter through the media. People quickly rallied online in support of Fisman, including many prominent experts that have been front and centre throughout the pandemic. At one point, the hashtag Thank You David Fisman was trending at number one on Twitter. Even the country's Deputy Prime Minister, Christia Freeland, joined in, writing, I am grateful for the expertise and advice of David Fisman and for the conversations he has had with me. Others from the medical community wrote about his relentless advocacy, his leadership and courage, others calling him a truth teller. Experts say the nuance of the situation matters. But Dr. Fisman's advice was the same given to the science table and to the teachers union. So there's no conflict there. Had it been the teachers union influencing him to influence the science table, well, that's another matter entirely. Even with the scrutiny, Fisman remains focused on the pandemic and providing his medical advice, tweeting out, this is not about me. I am one voice of many, and I am not going anywhere. Catherine Ward, Global News.